right now, day two of jury selection in the trial for the three men accused of murdering Ahmad Arbery. Today, more jurors were dismissed and the judge expressing his frustration over the pace of jury selection. Joe Henke has more on the developments from the courtroom in Brunswick. For the second day in a row, Justice for Ahmad! protesters gathered outside the Glynn County Courthouse and inside, potential jurors heard from Judge Timothy Walmsley. There's a case here in the Superior Court that needs to be resolved, and we can't do that without jurors, which means we can't do that without you. So thank you. But in a room where jurors are identified in order by numbers, not names for their security, there were missing numbers. The gaps in the numbers on your name tags between you represent the folks that didn't come today. Despite numerous messages, neither the court or judge's staff today provided information on how many jurors skipped jury duty or consequences they could face. In the small southeast Georgia community, it appears that many, if not most, already know details of the case. Have you for any reason formed and expressed any opinion in regard to the guilt or innocence of the accused? On Monday, 13 out of 20 potential jurors questioned said yes to that question. 69. Today, 8 out of 20 more potential jurors said yes. They already have an opinion on the guilt or innocence of Travis and Gregory McMichael and William Bryant. One juror this morning said they know Gregory McMichael. Another said he knows William Bryant. Do any of you sitting here now have a negative feeling about Travis McMichael? Four said yes, they have negative feelings about Travis McMichael. Three expressed negative feelings about his father, Gregory, and two have negative feelings about Brian. From Monday through this afternoon, only 40 out of 1,000 summoned potential jurors had been questioned, leading to the judge urging attorneys to speed up jury selection. At one point, Walmsley told the attorneys, I do not have the ability to just store people or keep them longer than planned. I am not comfortable with this. At this rate, we are going. All these plans we have to move these panels through are not going to work. Previous estimates from the court had jury selection lasting at least two weeks. At its current pace, that looks very likely.